Hello friends and I'm back with a very exciting belated video for you guys to see. Now we received our pet nature box in last week and given that I was on a whole load of crazy shifts again I decided to basically open the box and as well because Jamie never opens the box he never gets to see what the dog's reactions are like although he watches it on the video he doesn't get to personally see the lady's reactions when the box is opened he never ever gets to open one so I thought to myself well it's Friday I'm working all weekend I only have one day off before I'm back on for another three shifts so I thought do you know what you can open it so this box isn't really a kind of first impression for me because I've already seen what is in the box but I still want to share with you guys what we got in this month's box. The stickers and inside we have what I really like to see in the box. Now first impression of last month's box was just white tissue paper. It wasn't very colourful boosting to go with that kind of season of the month like I feel as if last year when we got the boxes the tissue paper kind of coincided with the season and it was really nice and it was a kind of like you open the box and it's like oh it's bright colours it's going to be a good box this month and given the fact that we had white tissue paper last month and we had a bit of an issue with a few of the items in last month's box um, I'm really glad to see bright coloured tissue paper in this month's box and I know it's sad to get all excited about tissue paper but it's a kind of like impression and the first impression of the box. Can you stop licking my pyjamas? Show me hold on. <laughs> okay so we've got blue tissue paper and I'm not going to hide this because I always hide this because so I don't see what's in the box but I know what's in the box this month so I'm just going to read this out to you guys and show you what we got in the box. So not only do we have blue tissue paper, Pet Nature box have been all out this month. Inside the box is this green cardboard kind of shredded paper, which I absolutely love. I love this stuff. I know it's messy, but it just makes the box look that wee bit more exciting. So I really like that kind of idea. So this is what we got in this month's box. Now, first impression for me was I was really excited about this box because none of these items we have ever had before nor seen before. So I was really, really excited um, for this box. So let me just get right into it. Let me give you guys a closer look there. There you go, if I can hide my face because it's going to focus on my face. So that is what we got in the box. Now the girls absolutely loved everything in this box and they're digging in to get into it right away, straight away, even though you've already seen what's in the box. Okay, let me pull out the first thing we have. So the first thing we have is AFP. Now as I said in last month, they seem to be going with quite a lot of AFP toys. I just didn't realise that AFP had that much of a selection of toys actually out there because every month we've had like an AFP toy and it's been different and it's like wow this toy is amazing. Are you excited? Come here then. Right, sit down. Right, you need to sit nice, okay? Right, so first of all we have an AFP Retro Fox or Raccoon. So we obviously got the Raccoon which is cute. Super cute, look at that, look at that. Pixie, no, you need to wait. <laughs> come here, come here. Right, sit. No, don't start getting angry. Mummy needs to read the leaflet first. Okay, so, we can get over how sweet these vintage style fox and raccoons are. The material is so soft. Good luck in trying not to keep these out for your sale. Or maybe that should say good luck. Good luck in trying not to keep these for yourself. Let us know which one you got, the fox or the raccoon. So we obviously got the raccoon and it's got a squeaker. <laughs> it's got a squeaker and she's away with it. She's away with it. And they come in at £6.99. Now let me just see. That was the actual, um, that was the bit that came with it. I kept that in the box just so you guys could see it. Um, 
So that is the first toy. She's not going to give me it back either. Okay, so the next thing we have, I'll just do the toys first. So the next thing we have is Animal, can't read that. Animal Instincts. And we got the duck toy, which is this one here. And Pixie absolutely loves this toy. It's long, it's hard, it's got a funny squeaker in it. It's quite hard to press, which she absolutely loves. Mummy's got her window open. Ready? Ready? Watch my camera though. She absolutely loves it. Oh, did you bring it back to me? I think you need to give me it though. Oh well, okay. Okay, so this duck toy, a bit tougher than your average plush toy. This guy is great for fetch games. It's also just right for carrying around to your pal's house for a pup play date. And this comes in at 4 99 Did you leave it? Did you leave it? You ready? I've not thrown it yet. Cheeky. So that was our toys that we got in this month's box and they absolutely love these toys and um, they've like not stopped playing with them since we actually got them so they are like really really good. I really enjoy these toys. Um, they seem to get on better with plush toys and actual hard toys. Okay now let's get into the treats which is what you're waiting for isn't it? You're waiting for the treats. Pixie's waiting for the toys, you're waiting for the treats. No surprise there. Pixie will you watch mommy's camera? Please. Ah, that got your attention. Okay, so the first toy we have is the first toy. Duh. The first treat we have is Fourth Glade Grain Free Treats. Now I know and I've seen that the food that they have for Fourth Glade, but I didn't know that they've done treats. So this is the treats here, and we've, as you can see, we've already opened them. Okay, so we got the apple and the blueberry. So Fourth Glade have been making great pet food for decades. Now this year they've really stepped up the game with cold pressed dog food and now these fab green free dog treats. Now these come in at 2 99 We got the apple and the blueberry flavour. So these are training treats, green free hand baked treats with cheese. And I've seen that you can get one for like joint care, you can get one for like shiny coat, you know, different things and they do different flavours. So they have cheese in it um, to help encourage obedience and concentration because cheese is your absolute favourite, isn't it? It's your favourite cheese. Mm -hmm. It is also grain free, it has omega 3. It has prebiotics, yucca extract, and it also has fruits in it. So it's got apple and blueberries. So we've got sweet potato, chickpea flour, vegetable oil, cheese, apple, seaweed, linseed, parsley, nettle, rosemary, mineral blueberries, chicory, prebiotics, MOS, yucca extract, and all that, all that jazz. No, that jazz. <laughs> um, okay, so these are really cute wee treats, and they come with a a seal, which I really like treats that come with that. It saves me having to put them in another bag. And these treats are super cute. So, and what I think is good about them is, well, for one, it comes in a love heart, as you can see. But you can also see a line down the biscuit. So that means that I can easily break the biscuit in half and give them a half a one and the treat will last just that wee bit longer because obviously it's a training treat i find that quite a big training treat for my two because they are small dogs so it means that we can just half it and give you half each yes and they are pixie and roxy approved aren't they they are very tasty and smell very healthy yes they are and uh, they come in at 2 99 I can't remember if I've already said that. Okay, so the next thing we have in our box is these Pup Cake Dog Bakery Treats. Now, these are... What are you doing? Have you got a bit stuck in your tash? 
silly. Okay, so these are handmade biscuits. This is what they look like here. And as you can see, they're in a nice wee tub. So these cute little pots of tasty biscuits are made with supernatural ingredients and are perfect for taking on a long journeys or in days out. And these come in at £2.50. And in this, we have organic wholemeal flour, chicken stock, oats, parsley, kelp, turmeric, and rapeseed oil. And you can freeze these for up to three months. And you've only to give this as a treat or a reward, and you have to store it in a cool, dry place. Yes, and these are in dates because mummy checked the dates of all these after last month's fiascos. Yes, I have to show everybody first. So that is what they look like in there. And if I take one out, that is the size of them. So they are quite small, quite small biscuits and they smell fabulous. They're quite hard, they're quite hard to break in half. So you can have one of these. Now this is all you're getting all day. You've got one more treat left in there and that's your tea time. Okay? Right, stand. Wait. Wait. Let me take a picture. Wait. Wait. Kick it. Back. Right, and we'll not get you to stand because you have sore back. So you give me a paw, and you give me another paw, and you give me a kiss. Good girl. Here you go. Mmm, <laughs> crunchy, crunchy biscuits. Tasty, tasty. Good for the teeth. <laughs> okay. Now the last thing we have in here is by a company called Raw Folk and they are again a packet of treats. So these are tasty turkey and sweet potato and they, it's just turkey jerky really. It's just like kind of dry dehydrated turkey. So that is them there. So these come in at £3. You guessed it from the name, Raw Folk make natural raw treats that are just air dried with no additive or preservatives. They are exactly what they say on the packet, depending on your dog's dietary requirements, you have turkey or sweet potato. So we must have got the turkey, obviously if your dog is obviously not great with turkey then you would get the sweet potato ones. The sweet potato ones would have been quite cool to try actually but nevertheless we got turkey turkey is something that they don't greatly get it's we tend to stick to chicken and that kind of thing so turkeys and turkey agrees with them it's just something that treats we don't get a lot of whatever treats we buy is always chicken there's not a lot out there to say turkey so we have some turkey treats and I know with the dog food that we have on A2, I know the A2 dog food that we have do have a new flavour out and it is turkey and I am very tempted to try but only a small bag just to see if they are okay with it. Um, I'm very tempted, I'm actually going to go onto the website because I know A2 have brought out some treats as well. I am very tempted to try the turkey but they absolutely love these sticks. Now, these are just like, basically, strips of turkey, dehydrated, as you can see. Oops, I just broke it. Whoops. And it smells just like turkey. So you want me about turkey? You want turkey? Right, right, right. Right, come here then. Right, right. Roxy, calm your jets. Keep your hair on. You're so excited for your turkey. Give me a kiss. Right, there. Don't snatch it though, don't snatch. So aggressive. Right, Pixie. Right, come here. Stand, stand. Gentle, gentle, gentle. Good girl. 
I have to say gentle because if I don't say gentle, she'll snap it right out of my hand and that's it gone and I don't have any fingers left. So everything in this box is Pixie and Roxy approved. I absolutely love this month's box and I cannot wait for next month's box just to see. Now I know last month we didn't have a very good box but it's not dampered my experience with Pet Nature Box. I am still excited to receive new items, new products and see. I just hope that we don't have any further issues with any products or anything in the future. Is that right? Did you enjoy that? You don't get any more? That's you done. That is you done. Yes. She can pardon you. Pardon you. So did you enjoy that box this month? Did you like it? Was it tasty? Is it approved? Do you like it? Hmm? You can't wait for next month's box? She can't wait for next month's box. <laughs> Okay you guys, so that is us. Thank you very much for watching this video. Give us a thumbs up if you like this video and as always, please leave us a comment. Let me know what you think of this month's box and I'll leave the link to Pet Nature Box down below in the description box for you guys to check it out for yourself and maybe treat your dog to a box. Please subscribe to our channel and I'll see you in the next video. Bye guys!